in life is to help those who are in trouble, to stand up for those who can't stand up for themselves, and to try, in whatever little way possible, to make the world a better place. He was a man who once ran across one of the busiest streets in Edmonton to save a child who had wandered out onto the street. He is the man that I aspire to be one day. Sadly, I lost my father to cancer in 2005. I love you, and I miss you, Dad. Thank you, Poxner, for your touching donation. Yes, we love you too, Poxner. We got $15 from Nicholas Block. Thanks for the games and the awesome event. Missed the Sonic 2 event, but I'll make sure to watch it. Put this money towards naming Steiner Violet. Thank you, Nicholas. We got $15 from Hector Martinez. This goes to whatever you want. $15, who wants it? Mystery game. Mystery game. $15 to mystery game. We got $50 from Sean Kelly. As promised, for the valor of the Sonic Jam players, even if they did cut it quite close. So you got the one from So you got the one from Hector Martinez. What about it? We put fifteen toward his fifteen towards uh, um, Mr. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, so there's an AV monitor top order right there, so you're good to go. All right, we're we'll all caught up. Should I put it back down to $5? All right, so for those of you just joining us, since we have so many viewers, I think it's about 28,000 right now, this is uh, Awesome Games Done Quick 2013, uh, hosted by Speed Demos Archive, a fine uh, speedrunning web website featuring hosting runs of over 700 games. Um, and featuring many uh, fine speedrunners from Speedruns Live, your main source for speedrun races. And, and we are raising money for the Prevent Cancer Foundation, a great charity uh, dedicated to the cause of saving lives through cancer prevention, through education, community outreach, and research. There you go. And we do have two awesome prizes for this yeah. Yes. Let's please show the and we will be uh, drawing the Sonic prizes very soon. We're just trying to get that sorted out right now. So we have center stuff. Oh wow. There we go. All right. Let's show off the curlers first. We have a group of punch out curlers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So, just practicing, by the way, guys. Just making sure there's no. Uh, there you go. That's good. Champion. And I won't get the speech bubble perfectly, but here's Mario. All right. Uh, we do have some more donation comments here. From Judgy, we have twenty dollars. Says uh, again, another twenty dollars to get Goldeneye to Double O Agent. Also want to see the blind folding of Isaac. 
So it's uh, so thank you, Judge. Ten dollars for all of those parlors. And Anthony Bye. Humes. And we have this. And our main prize for this game is this awesome Mike Tyson's Punch Out book. There's only three copies in existence, to my knowledge. That is correct. No. Oh, wow. Three copies in the world. Yeah. And this is the only one that you can get your hands so on. Do you wanna, so you want to donate. Do you want to say, uh, tell the story about this? Yes. Uh, the the book is authored by a guy named Daniel Lanciana. He kind of was really passionate about this game, and he also likes coffee table books. So he combined his two passions, and he enlisted the help of myself and a few other MTPO experts, such as Matt Turk and Daniel Teixeira, and we helped him with writing, editing, uh, and putting this thing together. Wow. So. Um, Unfortunately, there are not a lot of uh, hard copies right now because we're going through some copyright things, trying to get permissions from Nintendo. But once we do, hopefully there there could be more copies. But there's no guarantee of that, so you might want to try to get your hands on this copy. Um, so it's got artwork, as you can see, from the game. Um, it's got a lot of information on strategy. It's got a lot of like uh, things that are just random random info about the game that you wouldn't know. Trivia stuff about the characters, stuff about the programmers, everything. Um, it's 240 pages of just, it's, it's like an encyclopedia. Yeah, it's wow. really awesome. Yeah. I've read through parts of this book myself, and it's really detailed. You, If you think you know Punch-Out, you really don't until you read this book. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I know it sounds cheesy, but it's true. It's $20 donation, a one-shot during this entire run, so get your donations in fast. And just to clarify, we did reach the uh, the KO and Midget Sandman goals. We met all the all the Every all single one of them. Yeah. Okay. All right. So uh, if you guys don't mind, I, I need to turn the volume up a little bit because yeah, I cannot cool. cool. hear a thing. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, um, yeah. He needs to hear There's no game audio right now. Well, I don't think there's game audio on the demo, is there? No. Is there? No. Okay. All right. Yeah. Mike. Mike. Yeah? Yeah, that'd be nice. Can you hear it? Uh, let me okay. see how this is. Uh, can you hear it now? Yeah, I can. Oh, okay. okay. I guess, are we doing blindfold first? Yes, blindfold first. Um, can I turn I it up a little bit more, or is that yeah, going to be too loud for the... Just a couple more. Just a couple more notches should be good. That That's perfect. Okay. okay. Um, and yeah, by the way, it so, goes without saying that once he puts the blindfold on and starts the game, that is serious time because he needs every audio cue he can get. Yes, yes. That's, that is correct. Uh, and I, we did this last year, and I think I lost to King Hippo. Yes. Uh, I was able to rematch him and beat him, and then we got to Bald Bull 1. So let's see if we can maybe match that or do a little bit better this year. Um, I am going to be blindfolded, so. All right, while you're putting that on, I'm going to read one more donation here that we have from Anthony Humes. $20. This should put me up to the 30 required for the Wii U raffle. Put this towards Pokemon Gold rival name Spinner from Calzor 2. All right, once I lose, I will be taking the blindfold off. Guys, I hope nobody was expecting me to beat the entire game blindfolded. Um, but be cool if you did. it would be very cool <laughs> if I did. Yeah, hopefully nobody feels, uh, feels robbed by this. So I guarantee you that I cannot see. I have to keep my eyes closed anyway, because otherwise it would be really uncomfortable to have my eyes open with this piece of cloth against them. So um, if we're ready... Uh, just start the clock, I guess, when uh, when we start Glass Joe. I think he's going to get up. I don't know. He's up. It's all right. He got up on one. He'll go down to a star. There we go. All right. I wanted to get two stars because he's going to get up on a one count again. So, last Joe's done. Say bye-bye, last Joe. See ya. It's nice fighting you. <laughs> <laughs> box that gets up on a one count, they go down to one star. There. That is correct. There's that a lot of little tech pieces yeah. to this game. 
lots of little things. Also, if, if there needs to be donations or anything read in between fights, that's fine. Just anything in between fights is good, but once the fights start, it's just when I need to, to hear. So, um, am I good to keep going here? Oh, you're good to keep going? Yeah, you're set to keep going. I'm just going to go for this uh, dodge and star. I might miss it, but whatever. Ah. I had to go for it. <laughs> I would have got like a 37 or a 38 if I got it. So, I think. one other thing I don't think we mentioned, is it true that um, if you Knock someone down without getting hit, you always get the one count? No, that's okay. only on certain fighters will that uh, happen. Okay. So Von Kaiser's one of them. Uh, Piston Honda, who's coming up, is another one. Although, I probably will get hit against him. He's a little more difficult. The good thing about this guy, though, is he cannot dodge star punches as far as we know. So, And you can get lots of stars because his stars are not random. Basically, any time you hit him that he's not, uh, you haven't dodged, you're going to get a star. I think I think he actually took me to, to round two last year. Not this time. Uh, none that I see here, but just an update that we are over twenty nine thousand viewers right now. Nice. So. Uh, Blindfolded Punch Out at Awesome Games Done Quick, charity marathon put on by Speed Demos Archive, with some help from Speed Runs Live. Uh, yep, yeah, raise money for the Prevent Cancer Foundation. There are cool prizes to win during Punch Out, curlers, and a coffee table book that Mike's going to flash around here. Thank you, Mike. You want that coffee table book. It is too cool. That is a $20 donation. We'll get you in the drawing for that. $10 for the Perlers. All in one shot. And just remember, um, even if we're not reading off your donation, we're still getting it. We just can't read all the donations because we're just having such intense donation traffic. Which is an awesome problem to yes, have. Yes, it is a great problem to have. Absolutely. Alright, quiet. Yeah, <laughs> the classic. Exactly. 
I, I had to go for the frame perfect star. I didn't think it was gonna happen, but yeah. what, what, what do you have to lose, right? Do you win this fight in what, 14 seconds? Yes. Or that many seconds. Take that out of hand. Actually, hopefully that was under a minute. Otherwise, he might get up. You're 56. I think he should stay down then. Yep, yep. He's down. <laughs> All right, some donations did come in here. Ten dollars from Victor Fassat, who says "big up" from a French stream. Thank you, Victor. Catherine Pope, ten dollars. Hey guys, what you all are doing is great. Put this ten dollars towards getting Mike eighty nine a job at Sega. If that's not possible, put it towards whatever he wants. I don't know if Mike eighty nine's in the room, but thirty thousand viewers. <laughs> Yeah, you're good to go. All right, this is the guy that took me out last year, man. I want to get my revenge. Welcome to RNG Hell. of this game, he told me about that strat, so uh, thanks to him, because otherwise Kim, Kim, King Hippo is yeah. very difficult without that strategy. Yeah. That's really an awesome strat. Also, for anyone who's wondering what a TAS is, that's a tool-assisted speedrun. Check out tasvideos.org for more information. All right, we're ready for Great Tiger. Those, uh, those star stars that you get off of him, you have to do a delayed hit, and it's very tricky to time. I use a visual cue that has to do with his shoulder, but obviously that's <laughs> null and void, so you got to make do with uh, just, you just, just got to feel it. All right, this is definitely one of the hardest fights, uh, blindfolded, so this guy can very easily crush me. Um, hopefully I'll be able to, to give him a match at least. Um, he did take me out last year, and uh, he's no joke. But here we go. Good. That's a good start. That's a good start. Now there's some random factors that come into play.
Same thing that happened last year. <laughs> Too early. because he goes into another bull charge at 230, so. 230, 25, what's your KO? All right, we have a lot of donations to read here, a lot of right. interested uh, viewers. Patrick Drift with $20 says, great event, great cause from Xeon. Thank you, Patrick. Bob DeVries donated $10, says, keep up the good work, people. Good luck and have fun and defeat cancer. Bob DeVries from the Netherlands. P.S. Tim Langen, you're my best buddy. I love you. Thanks, Bob. Christian Ojanimi with $20 says, Greetings from Sweden. I'd like to put this donation towards a Super Mario Brothers 3 100% run. Thanks for supporting such an important cause. I mean, we're glad that you're donating, but uh, I think we've already told you guys we're about $600, $700 over that goal already. They really want that 100%. <laughs> I mean, yeah. you feel free to donate for it, just... <laughs> we can, we can only do 100% run. <laughs> All right. How do, you, how do you like him blindfolded? We'll cut it there so you can keep going. Well, it, it's it's going to be complicated. Um, I mean, I, I'd like to get him when he does his uh, kamikaze attack in one minute, but I'm going to try to beat up on him a little bit before we get to that point, so let's see how it goes. Well, at least I got two knockdowns in the first round. Um, I mean, I really want to just get him when he does his kamikaze attack, but if I don't, then I, I think he can get KO'd. So uh, I really don't know what he does in round two either. So this is like literally like blindfolded blind. <laughs> Thank you. 
practice this fight more. <laughs> I've never been to round three with this guy. Please don't get up. <laughs> Did he get up on one? Yes. Oh shoot. Get past him. <laughs> eventually, we'll just yeah yeah we'll just we'll get we'll get through the whole game eventually. So what's your what's your real time estimate for the for the regular game? Uh, for the rest of it, yeah, should be about another fifteen minutes yeah. or so. Is that are we doing okay on time or? Yeah yeah, yeah we're fine. Okay. Don't worry about time. I was just curious right. what to put into the estimate. Um. The schedule said 45 minutes, but that was for everything. Yes, me the sinister rage. So are you just continuing, or are you going to start? I'm just going to continue from here. There's, yeah, it would take it would take way too long to go through the whole game again. So um, we're already at the world circuit. May as well just keep going. <laughs> All right, before you start up again here, you have a $36 donation from Sinister Mom that says, Go Sinister One from the Sinister Mom. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> you are the mom. You can read donations if you want. This this is easy. All right. <laughs> yeah, now you can see. All right, we have fifty dollars from Andrew Spring. Says put this fifty dollars to Rockman and Rockman and Forte to remind everybody it's not Forte and Forte. My grandfather was recently diagnosed with cancer. Let's kick its butt so nobody else has to lose anybody they love. Can I turn the TV back down? Ah, uh, yeah, go ahead. Thank you, Andrew. Uh, Daniel Koivitso donated fifty dollars and says. So what's this about a book being available? I like books and prizes, and I'm not yet sleep deprived. I swear. Also, add this fifty dollars to the runner's choice. Um, how are we doing on uh, that Batman race? Uh, I guess I have to take a look on it. Have to find the tab. You got it. Okay, I'll keep going. We'll find out. Uh, Elizabeth Ziriata donated $30, says, Hey, Sinister, when I win that book, would you sign it? Also, since yes. Sinister, uh, your other game is Batman, uh, while he may not leave the NES generation of games, only Batman Arkham has challenges, so put this towards Batman side quests. Good luck, Sinister. Thank you. Batman race is at uh, 222 out of 300. All right, put All right. it on. Let's go. Uh, by the way, yeah, that, this gentleman right here, Funk Doc, uh, is the man that is running Batman. I have to be donated in to race the game. He is the true, the true Batman. You want to see so. it. it be <laughs> and you, you do want to see yes. that race. Right. So. This man's been stepping up a lot lately. That'll be a good race. All right, from Corodius, a twenty dollars donation says, "I'd better throw in more support for my favorite octopus slash father, Octodad." <laughs> from Magnus Nord, a twenty dollars donation that says, "Lala what here? HDQ is one of the highlights of the year. Love what you guys are doing." Here's twenty dollars to qualify me for the sick MTPO book. Oh, and Sinister One is probably the most underrated streamer ever. Follow him. I, I agree, it's a Sinister One, but it's a W-O-N, not the num numeral one at the end. We can be on the stream, so. Yeah, exactly. But, you know, we got, we got oh, a plug. Yeah. Thank you, I appreciate it. And we have a very generous donation here from Paul Fangro, $250. Says, I must have that book, put this towards a shark for the Pokemon Gold starter name. <laughs> Thank you, Paul, for your donation. 
James Rodriguez donated twenty dollars and says, "Put it to PJ's mystery game." Also, here's a question: Glass Joe's record is one in ninety-nine, meaning he actually won a match once. Any ideas on who it was that lost to him? <laughs> <laughs> the rumor was Nick Bruiser. But That's the rumor. There you I've go. I've also heard Gabby, uh, Gabby J. No, no, Gabby, I think Gabby J's one win was, was Glass Joe. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So says the manual. You know what? I think it might be in the book actually. So. <laughs> <laughs> Yet another reason to donate $20 or more during the rest of the game. Oh, that's what the book and not tell it. And a reminder for those of you that uh, are just joining us here, this is Awesome Games Done Quick 2013, and we are raising money for the Prevent Cancer Foundation. Uh, your donations here, $20 or more, will enter you to win this awesome Mike Tyson's Punch-Out book. Uh, there are only three of them in existence that we know of, and if you are enjoying the speed run, you will definitely enjoy the book as well. So uh, if you want to win that, your $20 donation needs to get in during this run. So make sure you do that. And we have members from both Speed MS Archive and Speed Runs Live represented here. And we're going to be playing uh, all throughout the week here. So be sure to tell your friends about it. Get on Facebook, get on Twitter, Reddit, any of those other sites, and spread the word because we're just getting started here. Going until Saturday. So it's only Monday. Uh, still more donations. Michael Carey donated $20 and says, Big thanks to everyone for putting this on, and special shout out to everyone who has ever been involved with the Sunday sequence break. Hard to believe it's almost been a year. Put this money towards PJ's mystery game. Thank you, Michael. Joshua Hughes donated $20 and says, Punch Out has always been one of my favorite games growing up, and even now. I love watching these marathons every year. Put this donation towards PJ's mystery game because I remember waking up to color a dinosaur two years ago. <laughs> and I'm excited for what he has in store. You will not be disappointed. It's Mr. K's mystery game, too. Yeah, we have a PJ $20 mystery donation K. from Poo Train oh. on site here. Yeah, Thank you, Poo Train. Oh, that's true. Is that much of a mystery? $20 <laughs> from Brian Wyatt says, Good luck to all SDA runners. Please put uh, this towards episode four for the Doom run. Thank you, Brian. And another generous donation from JJ Foot, two hundred dollars says epic blindfolded punch out. Put this towards uh, Sypha and CV3 from the Dope Fish. I approve of that. Is that your favorite run now? Sypha's probably my favorite. Yeah. Okay, I don't think There's a lot of really cool tricks since the last year when we last time we did this on here, so that will be a treat for you all if it wins. All right, $30 from Daniel Lanciano who says, I've never seen such finger speed before. Hope you enjoy my book, and hopefully it'll be publicly available soon. Quick shout out to Sinister One, Matt Turk, uh, Adelicat, Daniel T, and 8-Bit Tees. Very nice. Yep, that's the author. The author of the yep. book. Nice. Thank author. you, Daniel. I very much appreciate it. And $30 from Dexter says, I would be honored if Sinister punched me in the face like Little Mac does. <laughs> Keep it up, my master. Oh, and put this towards Ninja Gaiden Pacifist. Regards oh. from Dexter and Sweden. Sorry, I just need a break. That clock's not switch. Go ahead, keep reading, that's fine. We're good. I just need a minute. I just need a minute. Wait, what? $10 from Andrew Araki, who says, Here's to getting those perlers. Put this money towards PJ's mystery game. <laughs> $40 from Fernando Acuna says, Hey guys, great job on all the runs so far. Put my money into killing the Boost Guardian in Metroid Prime 2. Thank you for the donation. $20 from Mercury.com says, Go Sinister 1, you rock. I supported the MTPO book Kickstarter. I need to try to win it. Thank you, <laughs> you Mercury.com. A $100 donation from Patrick Bailey. Patrick says, hi guys, this is my first ever donation online, but you are doing such a great thing, I couldn't be left out. Here's a cool hundred for double O agent Goldeneye. We have a hundred dollars also from Joe Palermo, who says, thanks for putting on this event, would love a chance at that Tyson book. Thank you, Joe. Forty dollars from Gatewalker. Gatewalker here, making this marathon's donation. A week straight of gaming is insane, and you guys are awesome for doing it. Been tossing the link around to everyone I know. Put this to Mega Man 7 instead of 8. As if I recall correctly, Abda just got a new world record in seven. Thank you, Gatewalker. <laughs> I have to lose this match. I have to lose to show you the full effect. What is that? <laughs> 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 I've never seen that one. That's win pose. Wow. That's how they do in Philly. <laughs> 
from Casey Hanford, a $50 donation that says, uh, from the Chuggernaut, this is to get in on the MTPO book and a good cause. Also towards killing uh, Agrippa and Amnesia, he's such a whiner. We lost my Uncle Mike to colon cancer, and I'm glad to support a good cause. Props to Day9 for repping the event on Twitter. Thank you, Casey. Thank you very much, Day9. And, uh... Okay, some of these are showing up more than once. All right, I'll skip over that one. I know I read that one. So, uh, fifty dollars from Daniel Matt says this will be a great week. Thanks for what you're doing. Here's a little something for that amazing blindfolded run. Greetings from Switzerland from Silver Star. Twenty dollars from Ronald Mendoza says, "Hey guys, this is for my mom who survived breast cancer. Keep up the great work, guys. Thank you, Ronald." Uh, Jacob Ritz donated twenty dollars. Says, "Hey everyone, J Man again. This will probably be my final donation, but I wanted to say shoutouts to Sinister One for the amazing blindfolded run so far." Miss you, man, and here's hoping we can race Ninja Gaiden at a future marathon. Got to try and enter for that table book, as it's one of my favorite games of all time. Wish I could donate more, uh, but complications and a massive vet bill prevented me from putting the money in I originally wanted to. Good luck with the rest of the runs, and see you guys in chat. Thanks for the donation. Thank you, $20. Hope to see you at a future marathon. $20 from uh, R. Kopfer says, I nearly lost my brother to cancer as a kid, and we did lose my father to it in 2010. Prevention is the best cure, and you guys are incredible for doing this. Thank you for your donation. We have $100 from Kevin Pereira. Says, $100 knockout, way to take down that bull. Keep up the incredible work, everyone. That was Thanks, an Kevin. knock I found right yeah. there. To get him back into the Sandman Express quickly. And $25 from Marjorie Delamere says, Watching this MTPO blindfold run is amazingly intense. Thank you guys so much for an awesome run so far. Please put this towards the shirtless Caleb in Trihex bout. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the donation. All right, so I took a little safe on uh, Sandman there because I realized that in the course of this game, I've lost twice. So if I were to, to mess up and lose there, it would have been a game over. <laughs> so uh, still got him in round one though, so we're okay. <clears throat> All right, we have to play this safe. Oh, you do want to say something there? Sorry, I started talking. Ahead. All right, $20 from Jason Brideau says, I wanted to thank everyone out there for what they are doing for all the family lives that have been affected by cancer. I know there are many behind the scenes that are putting the show together and they should come to the camera and say hi once in a while. As for the 20, put it towards uh, singing the intro for Snake Eater. Thank you, Jason. Uh, from Renee Hero, $35. Uh, it says 35 bucks for Sinister's blindfolded punch out run, five for each win. Keep on fighting the good fight. Thanks, Renee. Uh, $40 from Andrew Iraqi says, great blindfolded run. Here's $5 for every fighter faced while blind. Also, put this towards Skyblazer. Thanks, Andrew. Yeah, Skyblazer will be played tomorrow if you guys uh, meet the donation goal. I think it's 300, 350, I can't remember. Yeah, you guys want to watch Skyblazer. Yeah, there's a lot of cool, yeah, there's a lot of cool yeah. zips. It's just a great game all around, too. Like, it's pretty, it's got great music, and really unique music for a video game like that. So, definitely recommend that one all around. If it wins. Okay, from Cyberbot X, we have $20, because book. <laughs> put, towards the S, uh, put, put towards SMK as rival in Pokemon Yellow. Thanks, Cyberbot X. And Aaron Riley donated $20, says, Great job on blindfolded Punch-Out Sinister. If I win the book, I want signed by you. Put this towards the Batman race. Thanks. All right. I am going to sign the book, so whoever wins it, don't worry. I'll, I'll sign it. All right. I'm going to need serious time for the, uh, the Tyson fight. Just You're FYI. Going KO, right? I'm going for the KO. Uh, so let me explain that for, for people that might not know. Uh, if you knock your opponent down three times in the same round, you get a TKO. They're done. The fight's over. Um, to KO your opponent, it, it varies from fighter to fighter what needs to happen. And for Mike Tyson, you need to knock him down twice in each round. So we have to go the distance, um, and then you can't get hit either. Um, it's, it's, it's kind of a, a tall order, but we'll give it a shot. Um, 
I, I may have to try this more than once. I'm just I'm giving everybody a heads up because this was donated for. Normally I just fight him and beat him, but if I don't get it, I will try it again. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, that's really fast. <laughs> um, okay. So we got him twice for that round, so we're, we're good on that. Um, yeah, but I might try something. Ah, uh, well. I'm trying it now. Let's just look at my funny faces. <laughs> oh, oh, that's okay, that's okay. I got a backup plan, don't worry. Nice free spray. There is a backup plan. It's mighty risky, though. That from Pat on the shoulder. Well, good news is since I've taken a hit, I don't have to dodge these. Try one more time. <laughs> Is 
that you cool? Have to have Can we get one more health? one more time? Nine count gives you full health when you get up. When you get up you on have a nine count. Full health to you have to have full yeah. health. You have to have full health. Yeah. Get full health on six nine count. Okay, so it's going to be a little different this time because I didn't get hit. So now I have to dodge his uh, really fast punches at the beginning of the second round, which is kind of tricky. Thanks everybody and thanks everybody that donated for the book. 
whoever the lucky winner is, uh, you'll definitely enjoy it. Very good job. Yeah. So, so and I will sign it for you. And I will sign it at some point. Yes, I will. And for all you who just joined, make sure you stick around. we got some Super Mario Brothers 3, some Super Mario World, and some Super Meat Boy coming up in the upcoming hours.